the day that Robin, my friend, is going to take me to Klang for a full day trip. He's gonna show me Pulau Ketam. He's gonna take me for Bakute. And we're gonna go to Teluk Go for seafood, which I haven't done like yeah since I was like 16. Before there was KL, there was Klang. This town's history goes back to prehistoric days. In fact, a bronze bell from 2nd century BCE was found here. On December 18th, two weeks after this video was shot, Klang experienced her worst flooding in 40 years. Robin's family home was also affected, but I'm so happy that he's totally okay now. So we are here at the Bakute restaurant. So I brought tea uh, myself because it would cost you an extra 5 ringgit if you order from them. I think this is a Klang. So the story about this dish is that the labourers who worked on the tin mines by the Klang River could only afford cheap cuts of pork and to mask the smell, they created this powerful herby soup that is now a delicacy. So this is the dry bakute. I have never tried dry bakute before, so it's going to be quite interesting. So we have some poli sang choy, which is cabbage or lettuce, I guess. And the regular bakute. Yeah. And look at this tea, it's so cute! After that delicious meal, it was time to head to Pulau Ketam. It costs between 9 to 10 ringgit depending on what kind of boat you take and we didn't have to wait too long because there are boats almost every hour. Pulau Ketam was made famous by a movie called Paint My Love which featured its scenic port and also lots of bicycles which we managed to rent. Well, it was an electric bicycle and it was pretty hard to get the hang of it initially but once we were off, we were off! <laughs> the only way for me to describe this town is just cute! It is super scenic very quaint and it's very charming because the people are all very very friendly and I just love the quiet and sort of chill vibes around here but also people are definitely doing business at the same time small town vibes of this place plus the fact that they also shot a movie I mean we had to do a scene <laughs> actors right <laughs> we bumped into this clang OG the guy with the red shirt here and he took us to see one of the local deities who has both a snake and a tortoise underneath the his feet. Snake. This is the tortoise. And right outside the temple, true enough, you see a snake on top and turtles or tortoises at the bottom. And then we bumped into this super friendly couple who were shelling shrimps for their business and they taught us how to do it. <laughs> And then we headed back with the speedboat, which I feel in COVID times is a much better option. Open air, right? On the way back, we also saw a capsized ship. Well, goodbye Pulau Ketam and hello to Klang Town where we went to watch Avengers! And finally, we ended the night at Coconut Flowers Seafood Restaurant in Teluk Gong. <laughs> this is what we saw this morning. Yeah. We have now finished our meal. I have had a full day in Klang. Robin has gone to pay and um, 
yeah, you can tell from my, my lips that I'm kind of cold because it is a cold day when I'm wearing a sweater. The food was amazing. And right now I'm trying this um, coconut flower wine, which is amazing. So if you're ever at this restaurant, like please order the coconut wine because it is really, really good. Cheers. Yeah. Bye.